So you have a business that's beyond the bootstrap phase and you may even have raised a little capital from some friends and family. You want to raise half a million to a million dollars, maybe even a little more. You've heard that angel investment is the way to go and you want to know how to find these so-called angel investors. Here's how you do it. In my experience, it's always preferred to get smart money investors. What do I mean by that? Well, in my personal experience, the best investors in your company are experienced investors with a track record that have significant domain expertise in your vertical markets. And ideally, a Rolodex of contacts that can be potential customers, strategic partners, and suppliers. The old school approach of finding investors still works and it's all about networking. A great source of leads can be large accounting firms, corporate commercial real estate brokers, corporate insurance brokers, or corporate attorneys. Angel investors are high net worth individuals and typically uh, are either doctors, lawyers, or people that are previous entrepreneurs. So they network with those types of folks. A good source of leads can be industry trade groups, the local chamber, chamber of commerce, uh, university alumni lists, and even the local business press. Milk your network first. And these don't have to be people that you know directly. You may know somebody that can make an introduction to that person. Um, LinkedIn is a great tool to you know, meet friends of friends or associates of associates. Next there are angel investor groups organized by different geographies around the United States. Um, for example, two prominent angel groups in Southern California are Tech Coast Angels and Band of Angels. You can also use the directi directory of Angel Capital Association to find angel groups around the country. Um, a relatively new resource within the last several years is Angels List. Uh, this is a good source of active angel investors and even a source of getting a syndicate of angel investors into your deal. The carry or the amount charged in fees on some of these syndicated deals can be quite expensive, so keep that in mind when going this route. I'm on Angel List and I've found that it's a great source for deal flow and new ideas. As far as where angels are located, while well, the center of gravity for venture capital investing and thus angel investing is still the San Francisco Bay Area, which includes San Francisco, San Jose, and Oakland, California. Other key geographies are Boston, New York City, Los Angeles, Seattle, Chicago, Washington DC, and San Diego. However, don't be discouraged if you don't live in one of these geographies. Smart investors are always interested and on the lookout for good deals. If you've done your homework, you have good customer traction, you have a solution that solves real problems in a market that's going to be potentially large and interesting, angel investors will be interesting. Just seek them out and find them. If you need any of my help in doing this, or you want me to look at your deal as an angel investor, I'm always happy to do that. This is Patrick Henry, the CEO of Quest Fusion, with a real deal, what matters?